my name is Samantha Reynolds. So I'm going to be talking about Antonio Brown. Can I just real quick know if anyone knows what's going on with him? Yeah? Okay. So just to give a little background on Antonio Brown, he was actually drafted by the Green Bay Packers and then he later what got traded to the Oakland Raiders, which made him the highest um, NFL paid receiver. However, though, his career with the Raiders was short-lived and he just signed a contract with the Patriots. Amen. So everyone started to think that, okay, this will finally get Antonio Brown's name out there, but in a more positive light. However, as you can see right here, I have, if you type in his name, this is literally what pops up. It's negative articles. So recently, after only a week of being with the Patriots, um, a former trainer of his, Brittany Taylor, actually came out and said that Antonio Brown um, sexually assaulted her. I won't get into further details of what he had he has done to her, but um, so she's filing a civil lawsuit against him. And so you have this article right here and many more that will go into great detail about what he has done. So obviously fans, that illusion that they had was very short lived. Now, this all ties into his branding. For athletes, brands are very big as it makes them who they are and it gets them known. So he earns $69 million a year for ta before taxes and that doesn't include his endorsements, but yet he can't pay his workers. Many of other lawsuits that he is having against him is that he isn't paying his workers, he has stolen from a charity, and many more. So all this is coming to light now, and people are starting to wonder, how is this terrible person still in the league? So this will soon start to affect Antonio Brown as nothing has happened to him yet, but people are starting to wonder when are our reparations going to be brought to us? When is this terrible person going to receive the consequences that he deserves? And as the one article um, towards this side mentions Bill Belichick, a lot of people feel as though Bill Belichick is going to hide everything that he has done, but it's getting to the point where it's too much of an issue that Bill Belichick is not going to be able to solve this issue. And many people, um, want to see this man, like I said before, receive um, like punishment. Now, this relates to class because we talk about a, a lot about brand and brand awareness, and this shows people that when you Google his name, he's a paid athlete, highest paid receiver, but yet none of that is what's being talked about. It's only negative. So now fans and just society as a whole is realizing this man isn't really an athlete anymore. He's a criminal.